Hi everybody, I'm Kimberly Edwards from cookingwithkimberly.com and this is what I say about food. And this is what I say about Clippers, organic white tea with vanilla. And that's what it looks like. If you can read that. All right, this stuff is super good. What is more homey feeling and comforting than vanilla? I don't know, it reminds me of all kinds of things my mom made me when I was a child. Baked them and puddings and things, mommy? Yes. What do you, you like this tea too, you said you like it. Why do you like it? It's so homey, I love it. It's homey, that's what she said. See, I chip off the old block. Anyways, it's a white tea, so it's a nice light color, like that wheat color, right? You only brew it for one to three minutes because if you brew it longer, it's gonna get bitter. Now, especially with this vanilla. Now, the vanilla is very soft and soothing flavor. You don't want something bitter biting back at that. You know what I'm saying? So go ahead and only brew it less than three minutes. You'll be happy you did. Plus, you also wanna boil that water and let it sit five minutes before you even pour it on top of that tea bag. That's how you do it. I didn't get this at my grocery store. I got this at Qualifirst Foods Online. That's qualifirst.com. That's what it looks like. And I'm quite happy with this, especially since I'm trying to cut back on my sugar intake and I like sugar in my tea. And these um, flavors like the raspberry, the fruit flavors and vanilla and stuff like that, they kind of trick your brain into thinking they're sweeter than they are. They're not sweet at all. So it helps me not add as much sugar. In fact, I haven't added any of this and it's still kinda, you know, I'm okay with it. I'm working on it, everybody, like everyone should, right? <laughs> anyway, I hope you try this tea out. I think it's very tasty. Mm. And I think it'd be really good to bake with. That'd be super, like if you're just using tea, an extra tea instead of water for baking, if you're making muffins or if you're making quick breads or anything like that, this would be a great addition. Just saying. Anyway, follow me on Twitter at Cooking with Kim E with a capital E. I hope you like the fan page. It's Facebook.com slash Cooking with Kimberly. My shows are online at YouTube.com slash Cooking with Kimberly and iFood.tv slash Cooking with Kimberly. My site is Cooking with Kimberly.com. Come out, interact with me, let me know what's going down, leave me a comment. All right, everybody, be champions in your kitchen and eat deliciously. Bye.